This is Greg from Greg's Weekly Guide. You may note me through this um, website, uh, which is about whiskey, but one often uh, forget it. This is also about music. I have a section about music and my musical taste from old classical, uh, baroque, renaissance music to uh, extreme metal music and uh, pop rock indie, uh, etc. And here, uh, this recent discovery of mine uh, through uh, YouTube suggestions. And uh, so this album from um, Whispering Sons uh, called Image, released in 2018, attracted my attention because uh, I thought there was a very interesting blend between, um, you know, post-punk music and uh, trends for from the 90s because post-punk is early 80s and uh, the blend with 90s early 90s music such as noisy pop or a shoegaze music uh, gives a very interesting uh, uh, very interesting sound and also the band which exists since 2013 uh, rejoined by uh, Fanny Kupens the singer a few years after that um, is uh, basically doing something which is trying to uh, mix you know this uh, dark intense mysterious uh, dynamic tendencies with something more uh, pop more um, ethereal more uh, um, maybe appealing to more people than just this, this uh, you know post punk style and yeah, for me it's interesting. Also, you know, the singer Fanny Cooper has a her tone is baritone actually. It's not soprano, or so she's getting almost as down as Nico uh, from the Velvet Underground. Um, the, the singer is very uh, low register, and um, and they they managed to do in this album, uh, uh, you know some very dynamic and very catchy songs for me uh, on 10 tracks there's almost seven hits yes seven hits um starting by god of light uh or alone you just heard some excerpts uh, also you know you have hollow you have waste you have no image you have a lot of very very good tracks in my opinion um, and uh, yeah, which is interesting, of course, the press talked about Joy Division influence in the writing, uh, also the performing. I, I agree with that, but not completely. Uh, at this era, there was, for instance, also you know, pornography from The Cure, who explored the dark, uh, moody ambience. Uh, ambiences in, in music. Uh, there was uh, also Skeletal Family, x mal Deutschland, uh, Bauhaus, bands like that. And um, yeah, um, and there's this uh, glowing guitars, very wall of sound sometimes, uh, especially going live when they go live, which brings the 90s shoegaze and noisy pop, you know, such as Ride, you know. The band Ride from from England, and all the Manchester scene and uh, Slow Dive, uh, for in, for instance, also can be quoted at times. And uh, yeah, this is a very interesting uh, for me blend of music. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I strongly recommend them. Uh, and also have please have a look on the YouTube, uh, you know, live performances of them, because Whispering Sons uh, really grow up on stage and gets phenomenal. I don't know who's the sound engineer on stage who controls all that, but it's very good, uh, obviously very good. So yes, yeah, strongly recommended uh, music, uh, the album, the performances live, if you like that, go to see them on, on live, uh, on concert, and buy their records, uh, support them. Uh, and if you like the video, click the button uh, like below, subscribe, uh, because you might also uh, want to see some uh, videos about whiskey that are coming in soon. Um, and yeah, some videos will be in French, some others will be in English. And uh, yeah, I will post from time to time uh, things that can uh, complement my website, gregswhiskeyguide.com. Uh, yeah, in order to bring my own uh, 
opinion and my own uh, experience of, of, of all that. Thanks for watching and see you soon. Bye-bye.